A top dog of crime who fought in the Omaha area retired today. His record for taking illegal drugs and bad guys off the street may be unmatched. Mike McKnight tells us what lies ahead for this canine hero. When Bezos jumped into law enforcement 11 years ago, the Douglas County Sheriff's Canine Unit found that his bite was worse than his bark. Well, from his initial training, I've got complete dental impressions on both hands. <laughs> The Dutch Shepherd, Belgian Melanois, could be tough when called upon, helping to apprehend 11 dangerous fugitives. He's protected a lot of police officers, a lot of citizens. But it's Bezos' nose that made him top dog in the sheriff's canine unit. An estimated $10 million worth of illegal drugs sniffed out over an 11-year career that has to come to an end. So it's sort of like a pro athlete. Uh, between training and then the actual game, uh, those things can take a toll on their bodies. and. Uh, this guy, we've gotten the most out of him as possible. In retirement, the veteran canine moves from the cruiser to the couch. Here's your official letter. Douglas County Sheriff Aaron Hansen hands the adoption certificate to Clara Shaw. Well, he is now yours. Thank you. Thank you very much. They've spent time with him already and know his daily routine. He spends it on the couch, in the bed, we do walks and you know, it's a frequent stop at McDonald's once in a while for a little cheeseburger action. It's not just deputies and sheriff staff wishing Bezos well with his new family, but other members of the K-9 unit ready to match his long career in law enforcement. And Bezos takes one last official sniff before leaving the sheriff's office for a retirement dessert, a pup cup. On your side, Mike McKnight, 6 News. Bezos deserves all the Big Macs and the Pup Cups. We love to see it, and we want to thank him for his service. A new dog has already reported for duty. Three-year-old Blitz is two weeks into training. The Douglas County Sheriff's Department has six canines.